Ed! Oh, oh shit. Ed? <laughs> Sorry, Ed. What's going on, Mandy? Where you been, buddy? I was just sweeping the dirt around there. I've been making compost. I'm still growing vegetables all over the place. There were snakes coming out of the toilet. And did you break my fucking window? No. No, no. No, no. So here's the deal. I got you a fight for tonight. It's a lot of money. I know you just fought. You're injured. Do you want to take it or not? I've still got some issues, Mike. I've got bruises on my shins. I've still got this bruise here that runs all the way up. I've got to fix my window because someone decided to choose MMA on it. My elbows hurt. I haven't slept for two weeks. My ears are getting cauliflowered. My back hurts. I've got toothache. I got punched by a monkey earlier, so that still hurts here. My neck hurts. My fingers are sore. I've still got more cleaning to do. But yeah, I'll do it. All right, so get all your stuff together and uh... We'll pick you up in two hours. All right? You gonna do this? Like that. <laughs> <laughs> That's fucking perfect. <laughs> I'm, uh, I'm pretty excited to be fighting again. And I kind of enjoy fighting on short notice, so I don't get time to get nervous. But it's gonna be good. I'm excited, so. So why Phuket, why fighting in these stadiums and living this lifestyle? I came to Thailand four years ago and stayed for three months just to improve my Muay Thai and then I couldn't wait to get back so I pretty much just I kept working at home and every chance I got I'd come to Thailand and that was it. Now I'm here, it's hard to leave. You could, you could be more comfortable in England or whatever but doing a job that you hate. But, you know, you don't have the weather, you can't go and do what you want, go to the beach. And, so the lifestyle in Phuket's just worth staying. Yeah. That's just something that came with experience. I used to really struggle with my nerves. I used to do all sorts of like little things like the uh, the tile in my in my bedroom open, so that my room would smell of a stadium. And you know, I just kept fighting and fighting and fighting. It. So really, now nerves don't affect me until like this stage where I'm sitting, sitting around waiting. I'm ready and just waiting to go down and fight now. It's such an unnatural thing that to make it natural, you have to do it until it is natural. Just keep doing it, keep doing it, keep doing it. Weird, man. Inside leg kick and then high. Inside leg kick and then high out. Come on. Be first, Dad, let's go. Yes. Nice. Same thing. Like it, like it. Same thing, same thing. Same thing, same thing. Chan, chan. Lord, up. Hands up. Patient. It's a good fight, you know, he, he's got to pick it up now, and he's going to have to work points. You know, obviously, he's going to try and knock the guy out, but we got to go for points just in case. So we got to mix it up. Him knows what to do. He's an expert. These guys are great, so they'll tell him what he needs to know. Too slow, Ed. 
that right kick. Be first. There you go. Again. Again. Hands up. Yeah, I had a tough fight, it wasn't the performance I wanted, but I, I took the victory. Um, both my shins are killing me. I mean, I, I fought nine days ago too, so both my shins were still pretty sore from then. Uh, it doesn't really matter how many times you, you fight, you, your shins always hurt because you kick harder. So, still, yeah, still a lot to work on. Okay, so Ad won the fight on points, he was banged up, been training hard, only had a two day notice. Two days. 48 two hours, days. two days, that's it, yeah. 48 hours, two days, like two days. Damn near a sixth of a week. Almost a sixth of a week. A sixth of a week. Speaking of week, this interview, <clears throat> back home. So the two-day notice fight, he took it. You know, he was a little injured. Uh, it played a part, but he's a tough guy. He, he fought the fight uh, the right way, and uh, he won on points. So we're very happy, we're very proud. Hopefully he heals up right, and uh, we're gonna go celebrate this victory. To the victor goes the spoil. Champion, champion. There'll be more girls Can't take this guy anywhere. How do you be polite to a lady boy when they're trying to do that to you? Those are the hottest chicks Ad's ever been with. So pretty, though.